Meredith searches for evidence of the ancient Egyptians' obsession with mummification. Oh, this is the scene I've come for. Okay, so what I can see here is this jackal-headed god Anubis, and he's enacting mummification, which was his sacred role. The image represents the very first mummification performed by gods, the embalming of Osiris. According to legend, Osiris was one of the first gods to walk the earth, but in a feud, he was murdered by his brother Seth, who scattered his body parts across Egypt. Osiris' wife searched the length and breadth of the Nile to recover his broken corpse. With Anubis's help, she reassembled Osiris and wrapped him in strips of linen, resurrecting him for a second life as ruler of the underworld. From then on, powerful Egyptians had their bodies wrapped and embalmed, so that just like Osiris, they could live again in the afterlife. This scene reveals the ultimate goal of the king, which was a perfect mummy so that he could successfully be reborn in the afterlife. The image depicts the myth of the origins of mummification, but it dates to the new kingdom, more than a thousand years after wealthy Egyptians began preserving their corpses. To find out exactly how the earliest Egyptians mummified their dead, archaeologists need to find one of the rarest of archaeological treasures, a mummy from the Old Kingdom. 